Y'all seen the title of this video, like, I'm here, I moved to ATL. ATL. I don't know, y'all. I picked up the camera because, like, it's going to be a new journey, but I'm in a... I'm in a mood because I'm dropping my sister off at the airport and I know in a few days she's going to have to do me the same way and I just feel like I'm getting ready to see her off. Cause I've been just finding all type of stuff for her to help compact what she needs for her trip because y'all know how it is when, you know, it's time for a trip and you got to go out of town. So she about to get on the flight and it's so crazy too because the same exact flight that she's about to get on. My flight is the same exact time on the same exact day next week. I'm telling y'all, this is so weird. I just want to show y'all the process of me doing it to her. And then, because I know I'm going to be vlogging when it's time for her to do it for me. I'm sounding a little sick. That's another reason why I haven't been filming. I've been going through a lot, y'all. But it's been rough, honestly. But it's been fun and... At the same time, it's been fun, even though I haven't done nothing fun, technically. I've just been working and, like, working. And I say working, I mean working around the five and, like, working on the things that I want to accomplish in life. But my camera finna die, so I'm definitely gonna have to catch y'all later. Let me take it to the airport. What's up with the gang? It's literally a week late. Is it a week later? I think I talked to y'all on Thursday. No, it's not a week later. It was Thursday. Today is Tuesday, which means I'm leaving in two days. I'm about to do some work on my laptop, try to come up with, you know, a little hustle or something to, like, better myself financially. And then I'm going to go to the store and get some stuff to help me pack my bags and prepare for this trip. Yeah, your boy really gonna be 25. <laughs> I keep finna drop my freaking stuff. Let's just go ahead and go where we going because I just cannot withhold the news. Put it on the grave. This goes out to you. You. Okay, y'all, so I made it to Walmart. We're going to Dominican Republic for my birthday. Ah, make some noise, y'all. What the fuck? I'm so blessed. Thank you, Jesus. I'm about to get my second passport, my second stamp on my passport. Less than a year. I went to Jamaica probably like five, five months ago. It was beautiful. I love it. I cannot wait to see DR. And I just know that this is about to be the best fucking start of my year even though it's kind of been rough already we're just trying to get used to a schedule you know but i do have a list that i sat there and made before i came out this is not even finalized but this is some stuff that was just off the top of my head so i need a battery for my key file for my car because i've been having to lock my car mainly lately that's fucking ghetto even though i'm not even about to have my car i just i need that to stop bothering me for these next two days before i even leave I wanna try, I wanna go back to the gold dial soap for my face, even though it's not too bad, but I just wanna get a consistent cleanser going. I need a do-rag, cause I always lose them. Used to take my boyfriends, but I can't wait to get myself together. I just been feeling like I just been looking crazy as fuck uh, the whole vlog. I get my hair done Thursday when I land in Dallas. First, I'm going to Dallas, y'all. I'm gonna be flying like a motherfucker, but I fly to Dallas Saturday, I mean, Thursday. Fly to Dallas Thursday and I fly to Dominican Republic from Dallas on Saturday. And then I fly back to Atlanta on Tuesday. So yeah. That's the next few days and like I said, I just wanted to be an amazing experience. I've been going through a lot these last few months. But actually this last month as a whole, but I don't want to talk y'all heads out too much. Let's go in the store. This wasn't even on the list, but I'm gonna get it. Thank you. 
you know, it's like I would talk shit because they got all the tank tops locked the fuck up. But these bitches like me is one of the reasons why they might be like that. All right, y'all. So we're back in the car, and we spent thirty-three, thirty-two. I'm not gonna lie. That's why I love. Oh wait, I got the receipt. Is that now? No, it was. It was right. That's why I love Walmart. You can tap it at the time. Okay. Shoot me. Here you go. Thank you. Somewhere out there, somebody who do good for McDonald's, but I'm not one of those people. I wanted to tell y'all, for one, it's sad because I just pulled up and this shit didn't even last. And two, I'm still not used to it, y'all. Atlanta, they don't do hot and spices. And that's what I eat at McDonald's. Lately, I've been having a soda for the regular McChickens. I always add that cheese. I always add that bacon. The fries good, though, and it's quite good. I feel like there's two things McDonald's known for. They Sprite and they fries. Let's do a little mini haul before I get into the next thing. Mind you, if y'all paying attention to the video, I'm not even gonna say the total again. <laughs> y'all gonna have to go back. Yeah, y'all gonna have to rewind this video to make this shit make sense. But this was not even on my list, but me and my sister been talking about it. So I got this to potentially meal prep, as y'all can see, meal prep containers. I need this for my key fob because I YouTubed it and it's dead. Of course, I just got some travel. Oh, yeah, why well, I just realized this shit open? I need to pay more attention. Yeah, this just, of course, you know, the travel stuff. And I got me a do rag for after I get my hair done. I got this just to. I'm trying, I told y'all I'm getting up. Yeah, what the fuck? This is broke too. <laughs> Girl, I'm gonna get that ass one way or another. So if y'all. Him, y'all know what I'm trying to say. Read between the lines. Yeah, I got this for, of course, the moisturize. I got this because I want to start using it for my face like a cleanser. But if that backfires, I'm gonna just use it as a regular soap. Because I also got another soap that I want to try. I have a little toiletry bag for a lot of this stuff, just to save room in my actual bags. I'm gonna start putting it up now, so I could, like I said, start saving room. But the first night we already have our itinerary for the first night at the bnb which i'm getting to that which i on the next vlog but just know that we all have to bring a card game or some type of game and this is the one i chose spend the dare it has like some good stuff on it like like for the example cards that it show you how the game go the first one says talk like a baby for the rest of the game every time you forget you have to drink then the other one says let the person across from you, go through your Instagram DMs and choose the conversation to read out loud. If they if they're not bold enough to do it, they gotta drink. But I got this small bag just because I want to actually carry this on with me. Because I mean, my suitcase is big, but y'all gotta think about it. I told y'all I got two flights, so I have to pay for Dallas and I have to pay for DR. But I have this. I got two of these soap containers because one for my regular soap and one for the face soap because I did get this Ambi bar to try. Hopefully it works, but if not, I told y'all I'm just use the bag. But that was the mini haul. All of that for the price I told y'all, I think that's pretty good. Now I'm just about to get to work and I'm trying to start this whole digital product thing. It's just time for me to start making money in my sleep, y'all. Like The way I spend money, and the way I save money, it does not add up and I want that to change in 2024. And my motto is, um, I'm not spending too much, I'm just not making enough. So, yeah. If y'all wanna hop on that wave, I suggest it. If you don't, watch me do it. Either way it go, it's getting done. I'm gonna close out and show y'all like how I end my night because I also work at 9 to 5 and I have to be at work at 4 a.m. So this was it for today, y'all. I mean, like I said, I'm gonna take y'all with me but it's more so, more so likely gonna be like a time lapse or something like that. We only got two days until we out the fucking country getting our second stamp on our passport, living life, and having fucking fun, making memories with the people we love. But other than that, I'll see y'all. Well, y'all will see me <laughs> working in like three, two, one. So 
So it's 1.56 p.m. I've already went to work for today. I was so tired, y'all. Like, I was late to work. But I just want to show y'all, like, it's Wednesday. I still don't have my package. It's Wednesday, and I still don't have a motherfucking package. It's my birthday, and I don't have nothing. And I fly out tomorrow. But it, but again, I said it's 1.56 p.m., so we still got a few hours before I disrupt. <laughs> I'm going to just take my hair down, wash my hair, try to figure out a style, because I can't just go to work and scare people tomorrow. That would be bad. Yes, I do have work in the morning. I'm going to go from 4 until about 9 or 10, and then I'm going to leave, because obviously I need to be at the airport. Two hours in advance, and my flight is leaving at 2.10 p.m. I usually get off at 12.30 anyway, but that's just risking it, y'all. I need to already be at the airport about 12.30, like, you know what I mean? Not just not getting off work. Atlanta traffic is insane, but I told y'all I wasn't going to go into detail about it. For real, until the actual video or update about how I feel about it all, because that's a part of it. But yeah, I'm going to just... I know. Mind you, still be going to work. People be asking for my number. It's 3.56. <coughs> when I tell you it's snowing in here. It's So, hold on. It's 9.58. I'm just trying to put something in my system before I go to the airport. My sister made spaghetti. I don't know what happened last night, honestly. Besides me getting discouraged about my package not being here. So, I just stopped filming for y'all. But after I finished my hair, I went to the store to Target. <coughs> And I got some, some more little stuff. My best friend texted me. She picking me up from the airport. <laughs> she said, it's time. See, everybody's so excited. I, it's like, I want to be, but every time I try to be, I just get sad. And I, my sister made this spaghetti last night, not for breakfast, so I don't try to be funny. It's just because I was sad. I just didn't even have an appetite. Like, I stayed the night with him last night, and I didn't even go to work because he didn't get off of me until it was time for me to go to work. <laughs> I mean, that's really what it is. I, we both upset. That's just it, and I'm just leaving it there because I don't know what's going on, but. I just want to interact with y'all more, what y'all think about this whole process and like, do y'all like shut down and get sad too and stuff like this or what? My package literally updated me and said it's about to come between 9.45 to 1.45. Mind you again, I just told y'all that I'm gonna be at the airport by 12, so. Fingers crossed, man. If not, I'm probably, I don't know what's gonna have to happen, but I know once I get to the airport, I'm ending this vlog, and I'ma see y'all on the next vlog. I'ma start a new vlog when I make it to Dallas. So, if you made it to the end, thank you so much for watching this video. I don't know, but all I know is, obviously we still gotta do what we gotta do. And that's what we're about to do. I'm about to finish eating and I'll see y'all at the airport. Yeah. Yeah.
my sister getting my, she trying to be me so bad, like, yeah, bye. We made it. <laughs> Yeah, we, we made, made it y'all through a hydroplane and everything, but through a hydroplane and everything, y'all I'm finna go home and not go nowhere else. I'm I don't know what I'm gonna do, y'all, without him here for the next four days. But we're gonna figure it out, okay? Okay. Yeah, <laughs> I love my sister. Perfect. Thank you so I much for you. bringing me. I love no, you. No, for more. real. Have fun and everything is gonna okay. be okay, okay? okay. Don't, don't let it. I know how you are. We'll talk about it later. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> She's talking about my fucking package still didn't come. Be safe. Okay. But yes, y'all, I'm at the airport right now, rolling the fuck in. I was up in there throwing my motherfucking suitcase together. Empty ass suitcase because honestly my package didn't come in. I'm gonna have to shop when I get around y'all. The lightning is getting bad and y'all know how it is in the airport. So I'm gonna talk to y'all later. So they grab hold of my hand.